right guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is an exciting day. We are starting uh, the first of our kind of organization videos that we're gonna do here. I just feel the need to organize the crap out of my house. There are nine people living in this house with a ton, a ton of stuff. We have um, a lot of square footage, but things, everything is just really confined into small spaces. Every room is very compartmentalized and stuff, so I really want to organize things because we do have a lot of stuff. We have a lot of people and I feel like it's okay. I want to throw away a ton. I'm going to throw away a ton. But as long as everything has a place, then to me it's not like, oh, I, I'm not trying to be a minimalist, I guess is what I'm saying. As long as everything has a place, but it's got to have a place. So if it doesn't have a place, it's got to go. All right, so here's the situation. We are having our cabinets done um, next week, so this has to get taken care of. I would say that I'm embarrassed to show you this, but you know what, real life, I've got seven kids. So things like organizing cabinets really just doesn't happen <laughs> all that easily. So the first thing I'm gonna do, because I'm not an organization expert. Okay, so I'm not an organization expert, therefore I'm just gonna take you guys along. Like I don't really know what's gonna happen or how it's gonna end up. So to me, what makes the most sense is to pull everything out, determine what's gonna stay, what's gonna go, and then sort the stay piles. Then I can start putting things back in and that kind of thing. So we shall see. I also purchased a whole ton of little clear plastic bins, white plastic bins, just a bunch of organizational bins so that hopefully I can make some sense of it. All right, so I just have to show you guys because I think this is really funny. So um, obviously, I mean, we have a ton of uh, like kids, um, kids medications and uh, I have some Plexus and it's just like random stuff. But you know what I have a ton of is random things like this liquid, this royal jelly, um, ubiquinol. These were all things that I tried when we were trying um, when we were trying to get pregnant, I literally took every supplement known to man. Everything I could find online that said it would boost anything and everything fertility wise, I took. So I'm just gonna throw all this stuff away. So that's probably gonna clean out like half the cabinet right there, is my attempts at fertility. The other thing is so much of this stuff has expired. I mean, I have kids vitamins from Honest Company, this baby and toddler multi-powder stuff, but all of this stuff is expired. So, and that's a problem. When stuff's a mess like this, you don't even know what you have, so you don't use the stuff and then it goes back. getting somewhere finally all right so I'll show you guys all this I've got it pretty well organized but my next step is actually gonna be um, I'm going to reline these cabinets I got some stuff I like better we're gonna be redoing our cabinets white up here and I like this liner better um, this has been there for gosh only knows how long so I'm gonna clean the shelves and then um, reline them really quickly before I jump into the next part, which is to make labels and put everything away. So um, I got this on Amazon, as well as these boxes that I've been using, so I will be sure to link everything that I can down below as well. All right, so when I actually got up here and ripped the old contact paper out, I actually just prefer the plain wood. So I'm not going to reline these shelves. I will probably still do the pantry, um, when it comes time for that, but I'm just gonna leave these like this because I like it better. All right, so here's the deal. These boxes don't fit this way in my cabinet. They have to go sideways. Um, and eventually, there's actually another closet, actually another closet in there in our playroom that's gonna be like kind of our command center closet where eventually some of this stuff will go, like the, um, the first aid stuff, the summer stuff. 
but for now it needs to stay in here until I get that closet organized. So it's gonna look a little funky, but um, it's just gonna have to be kind of how it goes until I'm ready for the other closet. So now I'm going to take my handy dandy label maker and I'm gonna make labels for all of my little plastic bins here so that um, it's easy to see what's inside. Well, it's easy to know what's inside. Okay, so just kidding. Apparently my label maker is out of batteries, so I'm gonna have to get batteries and then label everything after. So let me put everything back in the pantry and um, I'll have to label stuff tonight when I can get some batteries. Yes, are you helping? My little helper helper? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> All right, so this is the finished product. We just have our daily medications. We have a few kids that take daily medications. So those are in that bin right there. Got all of my <clears throat> essential oils. Let me get this to focus. Got all of my essential oils right here. I have some Young Living and doTERRA. I don't sell oils, but I have a few friends who do. So if you're interested in oils, I will link those down below to a few of those people I know that sell them. We've got like our little roller balls. Up here, this bin um, is adult medication. This bin right here is children's medication. This is our cold prep stuff. If you've seen that video, I'll leave it linked if you wanna check it out. But this is where you keep all of our cold prep stuff. Um, this is more of that daily medication, just backup bottles of more of it. And then just a few things for um, first aid stuff that didn't fit, like hydrogen peroxide and witch hazel and stuff. But the top one there is first aid and it will have a label. Um, I was gonna put the label on this side right here, but then when I move everything to the other closet, it's gonna go this way. So I may just wait to label it until it moves because that is first aid stuff. This is um, sunscreen and like sunburn and bug spray stuff. And this is all of our pet stuff, like flea medication and you know, pet, pet sprays, pet stuff. All right, you guys. That's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this organizational video. This is just the first, just a taste. It's just the first in a series um, that I have coming up. I'm gonna tackle the pantry soon. Like I said, we're gonna be building stuff in that closet in there and that's gonna be like organizational command central station. It's gonna be amazing. So all that stuff coming and I've also gotta do the entire kitchen because we're having our cabinets painted. So I'm gonna take that opportunity to clean out everything in our kitchen. So a whole bunch more of these series of videos coming up, but this was just a starting one. So I hope y'all enjoyed this. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And like I said, everything that I can link will be linked down below in the description box for you. So happy new year, happy organizing, a place for everything and everything in its place. Thanks guys for spending your very precious time with me. I really do appreciate it. It means a lot and I will see you guys again really soon.